we're from a student coalition at the University of Toronto to come out here and do a very visual demonstration to pressure our MPs to take action on Bill C-393. Uh, we want them to amend it and to pass it and to create more accessible medications globally. was formed uh, more recently after uh, World AIDS Day and with this bill coming up before Parliament for a final vote Access! on December 16th yeah! it is especially important for Access! us to be out here and to mobilize on this really important issue. I am with War Child Canada at UFT. They sent out an email. This issue is very important to me. I've done a lot of research on it and I figured it's time we did something active instead of just talking about it. I don't know what's going on, but it seems like they're very passionate. Um, you know, Bill C-393 would actually save lives, and it would actually pass uh, generic drugs through. Um, it would make it more accessible to people around the world. Right now, over 10 million people don't have access to HIV medication, and thousands of people are dying because of this. And we know that ARVs, antiretrovirals, save people's lives, and people are surviving, and there are less uh, deaths related to AIDS because of ARVs, but yet people around the world don't have access to these, and this is creating a medical apartheid. And we're trying to get Parliament to act to get us back to the old le legislation so that th these drugs could be delivered to countries that need them. So there was a coalition of us here today, uh, some U of T students, some community members, some HIV AIDS activists, and we had our Young and Dundas die-in, where we all laid in the, uh, the center of the Scramble intersection at Young and Dundas Square to uh, protest what has happened with Bill C-393 recently. And this bill will be returning to Parliament probably on Thursday, so we're hoping that this will get some attention around the issue and that it will encourage members of Parliament to put the most important part of Bill C-393 back into it. So I feel like it went pretty well. Um, we got a lot of attention, a lot of head turns, and we had a, a surprisingly good turnout for how cold it is. It's about minus 15 out right now. So I think everyone's really happy with the way it went today.